from the grieving aunt of a little boy killed in a hit and run on the turnpike earlier this week. Local 10's Cody Weddle has the latest on the search for that dangerous driver. Well, this family, of course, still in shock as they call on the person who did this to come forward. He really loved pizza, chicken nuggets and chicken wings and stuff. Nakisa Luis Jun remembering her nephew, six year old Azir. He had opportunity to have his first day of school and his first day would be his last day. Their family heartbroken after the boy died in this crash early Wednesday morning. According to the Florida Highway Patrol, their car broke down on the Florida Turnpike in Davie just after midnight, an SUV then barreling into their sedan. Before they even had an opportunity to get out of the car, um, a car struck behind them. The impact killed the boy. His mother and a male passenger rushed to Broward Health Medical Center. The driver of the SUV that crashed into their car then fleeing the scene on foot, leaving his vehicle behind. Witnesses say he had an infant in his arms. It could be an accident. Just stay. Why would you leave? You know, but of course they left because they know what they did was wrong. The Florida Highway Patrol has identified the owner of the vehicle who wasn't driving at the time. The owner now cooperating with police to find the driver, the family pleading that he come forward. We're all still in shock and disbelief. He was full of life. I mean, he was very bright, very observant, he always spoke what was on his mind and always told his truth, if you didn't like it or not. And after speaking with the vehicle's owner, police saying they do think they have a lead on who is driving that vehicle. Both the boy's mother and the male passenger have been released from the hospital. We're reporting this in Davie. I'm Cody Weddle, Local 10 News.